Here I will show you the details process of growing Exora cochinea plant. I will show, the organic pest control method, fertilization method, and Exora cochinea plant pruning system. So let's begin. Fertilization method. Fertilization needs for Luxra in early spring, using an acidic fertilizer formulated for Luxra, azalea and gardenias which has a ratio such as 488, along with minor elements that are beneficial. Repeat in midsummer and autumn. Acidic fertilizer is especially important if the foliage takes on a yellowish cast, indicating a magnesium deficiency caused by improper soil pH. Apply the fertilizer according to label specifications, then water deeply. Watering system. Watering is needs to keep the soil evenly moist, but not too muddy. Although the plant prefers moist soil, it may rot in excessively soggy soil. Water the shrub sparingly during the winter months. Pixora pruning. Prune Luxra after blooming slows in late autumn or any time the shrub looks untidy. Prune each shoot down to just one bud or prune the shrub as needed to create the size and shape desired. Azora shrubs tolerate pruning well and can be trimmed back by several inches without harm. However, many gardeners prefer to leave the shrub unsheared for a more natural appearance. Pests, disease, protect Luxra from aphids and scales. Aphids are tiny, green insects that congregate at joints of the leaves. Scales are hard-shelled insects that give the foliage a waxy appearance. Regular application of an insecticidal soap spray and neem oil usually helps to control both pests. To prevent fungal disease use aloe vera spray, 